Missing items are a pain, especially if they're expensive or if they hold sentimental value to the owner. Welcome to another video, and today we'll check out a story of a comedy club owner who found a mysterious item while they were renovating. Please take a moment to subscribe and don't forget to click on the notification bell as we regularly upload videos and we can notify you whenever a new video that you like is uploaded. Give us a like, share, and comment! Losing one of your belongings means you will be spending money when you didn't need to. You'd feel as bad if you weren't wasting money because you were more careful. Or sometimes you don't replace it and just live your life without it if it isn't that important. But if it's your wallet, replacing it is a must unless you want to keep your cash, ID cards, credit cards, and other type of wallet things inside your pocket. That doesn't sound very convenient. And everyone nowadays takes extra care when it comes to going out with a wallet as nobody wants to go through the hassle of calling the bank for a credit card cancellation or ID card replacement. And worse, no one wants their information circulating around town. And what's irritating is that when you were able to get a new wallet, get everything replaced, the old wallet shows up. That's what happened to an Iowa man. However, it happened after 71 years. Comedy club owner Larry Sloan and his friend found a very old plastic wallet lodged between the floorboards of the third floor of his comedy club during a renovation. It was still in good condition given the fact that nobody ever goes to the third floor. The building used to be a theater and it has been in use since 1928. Excitedly, they checked the contents of the wallet in hopes of identifying the owner. What they saw amazed them as the wallet may have been stuck there for many, many decades. They found a Boy Scout card that was already crumbling due to age and the picture was old and 1940-ish. They also found some old food ration stamps, which indeed puts it to the World War II era or early 40s. Judging by the available clues, the wallet belonged to a young individual.
Sloan then asked if he remembers a wallet lost in 1944, and Claire said he very much did. Claire soon got his old wallet back along with nostalgia that came with it. Sloan was glad he was able to put a smile on an old man's face. Next time you find something old and special, folks, try keeping it safe and return it to the owner and make their day. That's a precious memory that you will be making. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, leave us a comment about what you think is good and refreshing to see after so many years. As always, we'll see you in the next one.